All right, so continuing on with scientific notation, we're going to be doing our four basic operations um, with hand-in-hand -hand with scientific notation. So, example one, perform the following operation scientific notation. Thing to note, adding or subtracting, add slash subtraction, must have same base. Same base 10. So in this case, it's the 10 to the fourth power. That it has to have the same exponent. Otherwise, you need to make it to the same exponent. So whether you're having to move decimals or why, the reason why is simple. When standard form, if say this is 6 to the fourth, so 3, 4, right? And this was actually 2 squared. That would just be this. I'm not, I can't take 6 plus 2 because they're not going to add into the same decimal place or the same place value. So that's why you need to make them have the same base 10. Um, so from here, I'm just going to do 6 plus 2. And then we keep it times 10 to the fourth power. Unless this is greater than 10, right? A two digit number, and then we have to move our decimal. But six plus two is eight, so we're in the clear times 10 to the fourth power. And just like fractions, when we're adding or subtracting, our um, exponent doesn't change. So, um, and then, so here's a subtraction one. Again, I am looking to make sure that we have the same base. And as long as we have that same base, then we can move on. And so I'm going to do 2.5, oops, I don't want that yet, minus 2.1. And then we're going to do times 10 to the negative 9. And 2.5 minus 2.1 is 0 0.4 times 10 to the negative 9. Now here's one of those situations, we are not greater than 1 but less than 10, and we actually have to move our decimal to the right. So when we have to move our decimal to the right, uh, we subtract. So when moving the decimal, if we move to the right, we subtract. And for later reference, I would go ahead and write, if you move to the left, you're going to add. This is important, and it will help you, and hopefully you don't draw through it like I just drew through all of mine. But this is important, the right, subtract, left, add. It will, I promise you, it will help you get through. Um, so since we moved it to the right, we're going to subtract one. I only moved it one place, so I only have to subtract one. So now we get four times 10 to the negative 10, and that is our final answer. In the next video, I'll show you how to multiply and divide, and we'll get some real-world problems going on in there. Um, until then, 8th graders, cart right out.